Hey, hey everyone, Heather Petersheim, Norwex Independent Sales Consultant, and boy, do I have some treats for you today. So I'm so excited to not just tell you how great Norwex works, but to actually show you with some coffee, some raw chicken, a permanent marker, some nail polish, some white tile, some nice light carpet, little hardwood sample, and countertop sample. All right, guys, so the mission of Norwex is to radically reduce chemicals in our home and also to improve quality of life. It allows us to advocate by deciding what we bring into our home and also allows us to save a ton of money, space, and time. So what Norwex is famous for is our microfiber and our Enviro cloth is probably our claim to fame. And you can see that the one I have here is very well used. I actually am on take three of this video because I keep messing up and my kids are upstairs. So hashtag real life. This time we're just going for it. If anybody interrupts, we're going to Roll with it. All right, so what I want to actually do is show you how effective the Norwex and Viro cloth is on removing stains and also removing bacteria. So Norwex microfiber has the ability with proper use and care to remove up to 99% of bacteria from surfaces with just our microfiber and water. So you're not putting chemicals on. There is no waiting for a kill time. You don't have to worry about your kids ingesting it or it touching your skin. And you buy it one time, it's got a two year warranty and you can use it over and over and over again, okay? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start by taking, oh, and wait, I have to say, it gets even better. Norwex microfiber with backlock contains an antibacterial agent, that's the backlock, which allows our cloths, cleaning cloths, um, body towel, body bath towels, hand towels, pillowcases, sheets, pet towels, the list goes on. Anything with backlock actually is able to self purify as it dries, which is exciting, okay? I'll talk a little bit more about antibacterial microsilver in just a minute. So first, I'm going to do a few things. I'm going to take this coffee and I'm going to dump it on this nice light carpet, okay? So there we go. Big old coffee stain on brand new carpet. Then I'm going to take some red nail polish and I'm going to go ahead and put that on. I don't know that this is actual hardwood. I think it's like a, um, like a vinyl flooring. So I'm going to put some on there on this white marble countertop. Not really marble, but you see what it is. And a white subway tile, okay? One of my favorite stories is when we first got Norwex, which we became quickly obsessed, um, was that we were able to get year-old nail polish out of our carpet with just our scrubby corner and viral cloth. Okay, Ooh, I have one more counter sample for you. Just trying to do a little variety here. Variety is the spice of life. There we go. Okay, so next I'm going to take my permanent marker and I'm gonna put that on this faux wood, the whitish countertop, the white subway tile, and this countertop. Okay, so next I'm gonna take my wet Norwex Enviro cloth. And again, this is used. You, got, you guys can see that it is well used. And what I love is the way that Norwex microfiber works. It's scientifically engineered in a star or a wheel shape. So when you're using it, the super dense, and I mean the splits of this microfiber, one two hundredth of a human hair. Can you even fathom that? That tiny, millions of tiny little microfibers are wheel shaped and they're pulling everything inside the core of the cloth, keeping the surface clean. So here's our big old coffee stain. And I'm gonna use just the wet Enviro cloth Again, no chemicals, because why would you want to spray chemicals on the carpet that your bare feet walk across? That makes absolutely no sense when you can use something sustainable that doesn't impact our planet in a negative way, that doesn't cost you more money, and that's super effective without harming you or the planet. Check it out, you guys. Clean. Coffee is gone. One of my favorite stories is when I first started Norwex, I was keeping, um, well, I still keep travel and viral cloths in my purse. They're like a little version of this. And I was at my mom's house and she had spilled a whole pot of coffee on her carpet. And she told me she'd gone to the grocery store, rented the carpet steamer and the chemicals and the stain didn't go away. And I said, ooh, and I ran to my purse, grabbed my travel Enviro cloth. And don't you know, I cleaned the whole carpet stain with a tiny little travel Enviro cloth. That coffee was gone, nothing to buy, no chemicals used. It was amazing. Okay, so next, I, I rounded a little bit just so that we could let some of this dry on. And I'm gonna show you the Enviro cloth, but I'm also gonna show you our cleaning paste, which is kind of like a backup secret weapon when you would be reaching for something super harsh like bleach. Um, reaching for cleaning paste is a much safer option. Okay, so I'm gonna take just my wet Enviro cloth and let's start with this faux wood. 
And I love the scrubby corner in Viral Cloth. It's actually my favorite thing in the whole catalog um, because it's got this little scrubby pocket. It's amazing on your stovetop, on your counters, anywhere. So if I scrub, I can mostly get that out, but you can see that it's still kind of there. So let's take this um, like a faux marble countertop. And that pretty much got most of the permanent marker out, but the nail polish is still there. Here is our white tile. Same thing, that nail polish is hanging on for dear life. Some things like slime and nail polish, like you wanna use something like this, but some things just takes a little bit more elbow grease and that's what I wanna show you. Now my husband with his elbow grease was able to use just this cloth to get our nail polish out of the carpet. And if I sat here forever and scrubbed, I probably could, but you can see that that's still on there. Okay, and don't forget, I have the raw chicken coming up in a little bit. All right, so what I'm gonna do is take this wet and viral cloth and I'm going to swipe it through my cleaning paste. The main ingredients in this are coconut oil, um, natural, natural, chalk and marble flour. So I'm gonna take my wet and viro cloth and rub it in what's kind of like a dry chalk and that turns it into a paste. Notice my hands don't need to touch this. It's not a harsh fume like bleach would be. It's a much, much safer alternative and this little canister is gonna last me a long time. All right, so let's start with this. Little bit of cleaning paste, a little bit of elbow grease on a wet and viro cloth and I used like pennies worth of this cleaning paste right now for this. And this even, I wish that you guys could see this. This even has like little grooves in it. Gone. All right, so next up, a little bit of cleaning paste on the Enviro cloth. This is um, like a faux marble countertop. And again, a little bit of elbow grease and the cleaning paste, it's amazing. So the cleaning paste, I love it on my stovetop, even a glass stovetop inside your oven. Um, my daughter Emma loves to use it on her white shoes gone. Um, I love it in the shower on like stubborn, I guess it's lime scale, some kind of pink scum um, on tile, some jewelry. We always recommend testing a small area first. There it goes off of the tile. And, and you guys, I'm not even using the scrubby corner. I'm just using the Enviro cloth material, which again, it's so dense. It's one two hundredth of a human hair. Um, scientifically engineered microfiber. It's third party tested and it's even got that antibacterial agent in it. So what I would do, isn't that amazing you guys? So what I would do when I'm done, rinse it really well, hang it by the attached tag and it will actually go to work to self purify as it dries. But how can I prove to you that when I say it can remove up to 99% of bacteria, we are third party tested, but I actually wanna show you with raw chicken right now. So I'm gonna take this raw chicken, ew, smear it all over my Norwex cutting board. And Norwex actually, um, we're proud to use recycled materials. And this cutting board is made from recycled rice husks. We care very much about the planet, the creatures in our ocean. Norwex is not tested on animals. And what I'm doing, you can see where that's wet from the chicken. I'm actually taking a sample of that area. Okay. And next, I'm kind of shaking up this swab, and I want you to see that the water has turned purple. On this swab, which tests for surface cleanliness, green means clean, and the more towards purple you go, the nastier the surface, okay? So what I'm gonna do is take, again, just my wet Norwex and Viral cloth, no chemicals. I don't have to worry about my hand touching this. I don't have to worry about my kids ingesting it nothing to keep buying, no nasty wipes or sprays to keep under my sink. And I'm going to wipe my cutting board where I smeared the chicken and I'm gonna go further and I'm gonna wipe the whole cutting board. And you're probably thinking, oh my goodness, you're smearing that chicken all over the place. Remember I told you that Norwex microfiber is so dense, it removes up to 99% of bacteria from surfaces and those wheel shaped fibers pull everything into the core of the cloth. So I'm gonna take another swab and I'm gonna check the middle where I smeared that chicken. And then I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna check the whole board, okay? And green means clean. Remember I told you the more towards green we go, the more clean the surface. It's green and if you think I'm being tricky, I'm gonna go ahead and swab that chicken. And you can see even the tip turns purple. Ugh, 
nasty, right? turns purple. Okay, so hopefully that excites you guys as much as it excites me. When I first got my Norwex um, almost two years ago now, it changed my life. I literally got my Norwex Enviro cloth wet. I had a window cloth with it. Those two are like peanut butter and jelly, the Enviro cloth and window cloth. And I literally could not stop cleaning my house. My back hurt the next day. I was cleaning the walls and the counters and light switches and the, the trim on the floor and doors and getting stickers off of furniture that had been there for a super long time. Um, cleaning just literally every surface in my home and I was blown away. So Norwex actually saves the average family of four, $600 a year when they switch. You're also really saving the health of your home because you're not bringing toxic chemicals in um, and you are impacting the planet by using something over and over again instead of being wasteful. So hopefully you guys loved my little demo. If you have more questions, please ask. Um, Norwex is such a generous company that by hosting a Norwex party, you are actually able to earn an Enviro cloth and a ton, and I mean a ton, of other free products without even having to make a purchase while making a difference. Um, my team is called Team Ocean, and we believe that one drop, we aren't as, a, as impactful as we are all together, right? So together we're an ocean, one person is a drop. And one person can make such a huge difference. One of my favorite quotes is, if you think you're too small to be effective, you've never been in bed with a mosquito. So it's super true. I started my Norwex journey almost two years ago. Um, and since then, I have well over a thousand customers, probably well over 2000 customers, a team of over 300 people. And alone, I can only do so much. But all of us together, each helping people make these switches. Think about the impact of plastic just on all of those my 2000 2000 customers homes and then the 300 people under me each doing the same thing it's amazing it's exciting and when you make one simple switch like this you're going to save money you're going to feel better about the choices you're making for the health of your home and you're also going to have an impact on our planet so thank you guys for watching um, if you have questions drop them below and i hope to talk to you soon have a great day